Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Antonia and today I have a little bit of a vloggity vlog for you I figured I would do some vlogging. My room is a complete disaster right now like utter disaster Because I have presents everywhere in my room right now for people and I need to like pack them up and send them off this year for Christmas obviously is not going to be very traditional because you can't see half the people that you would normally see in person so I'm shipping off a lot of my packages um, I'm so sorry to all like the postal workers FedEx workers UPS workers if you work in delivery like thank you guys so much because without you you can't you know our stuff wouldn't get into the hands of our loved ones so anyways um, I'm not gonna show you the floor because there's like so many presents that I just need to package up um, and then uh, my room is a complete mess like what is going on and then because my room was a complete mess I decided that I would be more festive I don't decorate in here so I'd be more festive and film in my living room but then I made a huge mess in my living room so I have to go and clean that up and then I need to drink my water and I have a jong um, boiling in the water right now so I'm gonna eat that after if you don't know what a jong is I don't know what it's called in Mandarin so it's another day I just wanted to show you this little bag I got for my birthday my friend Ming and her family gifted this to me I'll show you guys my outfit today I'm wearing the Wilfred Free Tamu t-shirt this is like a turtleneck I have on some jewelry on top I'll show you guys closer later I have these modern cargo pants from Wilfred Free as well I took the belt from my TNA cargo pants that TNA had a while ago. This belt comes with the cargo shorts as well. And then I have here an Annie and Mercy extra large champagne scrunchie. I love it. It's huge. I have it looped around three times. Then on my jewelry, I have the H pendant. It's a diamond pendant. This is the baby box chain, and this is the zodiac necklace in my zodiac, which is Sagittarius and then I'm going to be carrying my new little coach backpack that my friend gave me I'm so excited so I'll have this and I think I'm just gonna wear my chunky Zara boots as my shoes and I need to pick a coat because it is cold sorry trash trash taste is playing in the background you guys I'm, I'm a simp for them find the vlog in the back I'm watching a Disney vlog but I wanted to show you guys the Academy backpack real quick in depth um, this is from coach it's the coach Academy backpack I know you can't see me maybe if I sit back more no you still can't see me anyways it doesn't matter y'all know what I look like so this is the coach men's Academy backpack it is full leather it has gunmetal hardware on the back there's this like I don't know I guess it's like the meshy material which is nice and comfortable um, there's a big pocket it literally is just like the Palm Springs mini except this pocket is accessible so I put a hand sanitizer in there I got my reusable straws in there and then I have a um, bomb self or skin bomb in there and it all fits which is great and it zips nicely and then this has double zippers as well in case you want to zip one side or the other but when you open it this is the mini bag I have a reusable bag that folds up like this I actually got this from Ming as well she gives me a lot of gifts and then she got me this new upgraded little backpack that I keep my um, allergy pills and stuff in and my lip balm in it has a keychain but I don't keep it on anything but anyways it's like basically like mini, my mini emergency kit so I have that which is really cute and this one's Disney she's like there was a black one and there's a red one thank god she got me the black one because y'all know how I feel about red even though I have something that I'm gonna show you guys right now but there's a little Mickey there it's really cute and my phone does fit this is the iPhone um, 11 Pro regular and it fits inside so just in case and then I have this which is something my friend Ming also got me this is just um, cotton swabs so I have that and then my keys usually fit in and there's just one big compartment on the inside with this and this was in the Palm Spring Mini 2 before they have this big oh what is that a care card but there, there's a pocket here as well in the Palm Springs Mini, which is cool. And then, yeah, so the construction is basically the same. I think this is a little bit smaller than the Palm Springs Mini, but the 
zipper is exposed so it's easier I, I mean the new Palm Springs mini zipper is exposed too but whatever um, this is like a little bit tinier and then it just has one strap which is like a guitar strap it is a nylon guitar strap and you just wear it over your body like so the back has three loops so it's one two and three and I don't know why they did that I kind of wish it came with two straps or like a way to hook it so I could wear this crossbody or like as a backpack but it doesn't I emailed them to ask if I could buy another one of these so I'll keep you guys posted on that but I really love it and then now coach has this new thing where if you buy a bag you can get it monogrammed with whatever you want on it which I really oh see this is what I mean my glasses so um you can get a bag and then if you have this little because they have this little like chain thing or like a keychain thing that hangs from their bags you can get this monogram so I got mine monogrammed with Harley oh I just realized they did it upside down like this side says coach this side says Harley but it's like flipped I guess it doesn't really matter but anyways, they put his whole name, and then the girl was so enthusiastic. I didn't actually go. My sister went for me, and she said that she wanted to put two paw prints. We just did one. How stinking cute. Yeah, so I really like this bag. I think it's really nice, and it smells good. It was made in Vietnam, in case anyone's wondering. I think it retails for, like, around 300 Canadian. Um, and then I saw, because I when I went to look at that bag... Um, that's how my friend knew I liked it. We were looking at it. It was like on sale for around 200 and something, but they're pretty like hard to find right now because I guess people are buying them. Anyways, and then she also got me this Mickey sweater, which is really cute. I know I don't normally like red, but this one's really cute. Vicky said I can keep it for... Oh, thanks. You're gonna hold it for me? Hi, Lauren. Vicky was like... Don't mind my furniture in the back. Oh yeah, this is Vicky's furniture in the back. Um, Vicky said I should keep it as my Christmas sweater, which is why I wore it in my holiday gift guide. It's gonna be my new Christmas sweater, slash Chinese New Year sweater, slash Valentine's Day sweater. One red sweater is enough for me, but I really like how it's embroidered and it also has the Mickey's original. Ming did give me a gift card in case I wanted to exchange it, but it's already pretty cute. Plus, she has one, so we're going to match. Hi, baby bear bangles. Okay, I wanted to show you guys this. Oh, no. I think because of the... I think because of the tree, my camera's doing weird stuff. Anyways, my friend Victoria made me this advent calendar for my birthday, and I'm excited. I get to open it today because I didn't see her. Like, she didn't drop it off until now, so it didn't start until December 6th, which is when I'm filming this. I know this vlog is all over the place, so I'm very sorry. I need to find six. Oh, here it is. So let's open it up. I thought it was so cute that she made me this. Okay, let's open it up. Ooh, Harley, what is it? Oh my God, don't show me. I'm just helping him. Carbles. Well, Harley's getting a treat. One for flavor, one for savor. That one's for flavor. One for flavor, one for savor. Okay, so here's the first item. Ooh, cotton candy belts. Delish. Hey, you bro. These are from Squish. And I'm very excited because I love Squish. Squish is made from Montreal. Oh, Harbles. Um, actually, they're not made from Montreal. I think they're just based in Montreal. Some of these are made in, like, the Netherlands, Germany. Cool. Thanks, Victoria. Okay, excuse my appearance. I just um did my workout but i figured i would unbox some packages with you guys because i got the packages harley is hardcore sniffing them right now so i placed some orders probably during black friday and honestly the mail has been really slow lately because obviously everyone's doing a lot of online shopping and stuff so i finally got them after like i don't know two weeks or so binkles you gotta go pee pee after i'll take you out what you smelling? You're really into it, eh, Harley? Harley, just a little fun fact for you guys, he loves opening packages. He loves to see if he gets anything. Um, I used to buy him Bark Box, but he doesn't eat any of the treats because he has, um, obviously, a lot of tummy issues. Hit this guy. 
he's going crazy. He just, he loves, oh, I hate that. The lighting always does that when, because I'm like next to the Christmas tree. Anyways, I got a golden mask from Sephora and then I got a mini mega mushroom relief thing from Origins. I'm gonna put this in my mom's um, stocking. And then it was my birthday recently. So uh, my one qualm about Sephora is that you are supposed to be, when you are rouge, be able to pick like the Charlotte Tilbury gift. Since my birthday's at the end of the year, I didn't get it. So I got this disgusting cocoa bum thing. It smells really gross to me and I don't like scents. So I don't know what to do with it. It was either that or milk makeup. And honestly, I don't like milk makeup either. Then I got this tattoo liner because I figured I just wanted to have a tattoo liner, like a um, an eyeliner, even though I don't really like Kat Von D. And then I got, ooh, this one's cool. Summer Friday Lip Butter Balm. You guys know I have obsessions over like skincare and lip products. So I got one of those. And then lastly, I picked up a gift. So I don't wanna show you guys what that is in case the person watches because this person watches all my videos. So that's the Sephora items. And then let's open the Essence box. So Essence had a sale on Black Friday as well. Um, and Essence is like a Montreal based like luxury, I guess like e-commerce, but they, I think they have a store in Montreal that I've never been to, but um, that's where my, I bought my first Givenchy Antigona bag. My first and only Givenchy Antigona bag. God, what is happening? So I bought a gift for my uncle for Christmas. Let's see what it looks like. They wrapped it really beautifully. And to reveal. Ooh. Okay, so I got him this Y3, um, basically crew neck sweater. It feels really nice and heavy duty. And it says, it's like a mesh sweater and then on the back it says Yamamoto Y3 so I figured he would like that I think it was like on a super sale it was like around um maybe a hundred and fifty dollars so it was a pretty good deal anyways yeah that's my purchases I'm still waiting for some items to come in but I guess I'll show you that later if anything comes in. Okay, y'all, I just filmed a holiday outfits video or a realistic holiday outfit video, and then my neighbor knocked on the door and gave me some peanut brittle that she just made. I'm so excited to eat that. And then I also have a package for Harley that just came. So, baby boy, you cannot have peanut brittle. I'm so sorry, there's sugars in it that you can't eat. I'm so sorry. You can have your, a puppuccino later that I made you, okay? Oh my gosh, look how good that looks. Anyways, Harley got a very special delivery. I ordered this two days ago and it came so quickly, especially with the holiday rush. I didn't think he was going to get into like next week, but I got him a new Casper bed. This is his Christmas present. He has a Casper bed already, um, but I wanted one for the living room so he could be more comfortable. He knows this is his. Uh, and I'm actually gonna open it now so he will just have it because like why wait till Christmas? But anyways, this is his Christmas gift from me and Vix. And it's just, Harley really loves Casper. If you have a dog and you want your dog to have a really nice bed, I really highly suggest getting them a Casper bed. It's Harley's favorite bed ever. Harley has a bed on each floor and he has like this one that he has here. It's from like PetSmart. And then he has some that are just like cushions that are from like uh, HomeSense, but he doesn't like those beds as much as he likes the Casper dog bed. I have the gray one in a large and then this is the medium size. So let's unbox it. Woohoo! And then the zipper just tucks right in there. Okay, so here's his dog bed. Now that I put it together, I think it'll be fine. It's a little bit smaller than his other dog bed, but let's see if he will enjoy this. Maybe I should've got the large. Okay, I put a, 
I put a cover over it, like a blanket over it, just so he wouldn't get it dirty, but it's kind of small for him. But I think it might be okay, because the large was literally so huge in the living room, it like took up like way too much space. I wish there was like an in-between size. So I'm gonna try it out and see if he's okay with it. If he's not okay with it, then I'll have to exchange it for the large size. Is it okay, Vinicius? Do you like it? <laughs>